welcome to Music with Miss Amy at home. I'm so glad you could join me today. I also want to wish you and your family a belated happy 4th of July. I hope you had a wonderful celebration with your family and friends. Today's lesson is going to be about summer and maybe some things about um, animals in the water and a little bit of 4th of July patriotic music as well. So it's just going to be a fun summer celebration and I am so excited you're here with me. So before we get started, a few things you want to make sure you have. You want to make sure you have some space to move around. I'm sitting on a chair, but I can get up and make sure that I can move my body. One other thing we want to make sure we have an instrument. Let's see. Uh, in here I have my little jar of instruments, my drum of instruments, if you will. So take a look and see what you have. You might have a little shaker. You might have a little tambourine. You might have a little shaky egg or a bell. Grab something you can shake. If you don't have an instrument, that is totally fine. A box of rice, a box of pasta, um, a little container of breadcrumbs would be great. So go ahead and grab maybe um, two different choices for instruments. If you have a little American flag, feel free to grab that or you can just wave your hand later. So go ahead and grab your materials and I will see you in just a moment. Okay, now that we have our space prepared and we have plenty of room, go ahead and stretch your arms out. Maybe stretch up tall one side, stretch to the other side. Good, and move back and forth a little bit. Make sure you have space to move, okay? Good, and now let's cuff our hands a little bit. Very nice, and we'll do our welcome song, okay? Here we go. Welcome, welcome everyone. Now we're here, let's have some fun. First we clap our hands just so. Then we bend and touch our toes. Welcome, welcome everyone. Now we're here, let's have some fun. Good job, let's give ourselves a round of applause. Great work, friends. So, since today's theme is summer, I thought it would be good for our sign language word of the day to be summer. So you're gonna take your hand and you're gonna get your little pointer finger ready. And what you do is you wipe across your forehead. So right here is your forehead, right here. Can you find your forehead, above your forehead? So now we're gonna take our pointer finger, our first finger, and we're gonna wave it across, okay? So like like this is summer. Can you try it? Point your finger. Go like this. And that is summer. Happy belated 4th of July. Do you know what the 4th of July is? It means that it is a day that the United States of America, the country that we live in, we celebrate our Independence Day. It's a very special holiday for all of us. And you might see a lot of people waving our American flag. Do you see our flag? We have three colors on the flag, red, white, and blue, and 50 stars for our 50 states. So one, why am I telling you this? One of the words that we are gonna do today for our sign language words of the day is flag. So you're gonna take your arm and you're gonna make the ground then you're gonna take your other arm and make a little flagpole. We're gonna turn our hand like a little flag and then we wave. And that's the sign language for flag. Yeah, so let's try that one more time. Make your ground with one arm, take your other arm to make your flagpole, turn your top hand here and make your flag. And that is the sign language for flag. Good job. The next word we're gonna do is America because the 4th of July is a celebration of America. So you're gonna take your hands, wave your hands for me, and we're gonna try to move all our fingers together. This is a little tricky for my little friends, so just take your time. So we're gonna lock our hands like this, and then we're gonna act like we're mixing it in the pot. Like a 
big melting pot. And that's America. So I'll show you again, wave your hands, and then you're gonna mix your fingers one after the other here, like this, and lock them together, because we are all united together, yeah. And then we're gonna take our hands and mix them up. And that is a sign language for America. Great job. So to continue our 4th of July mini celebration, I thought it would be fun to do a song about America and about our flag, especially since we just learned America and we learned flag. So there is a song about our American flag that is called You're a Grand Old Flag. So check out your house and see if you have these items and if you don't no big deal one thing i have is i have an american flag so you can wave that to the beat and that could be fun to use if you don't have that not a problem something else i might use for this song is my eggy shaker okay if you don't have an egg shaker you can use a box of rice a box of pasta a bag of rice or pasta you can shake um, breadcrumbs like I did in the previous class that worked out as a really nice maraca type so uh, sound to it so feel free to grab uh, whatever makes you happy that'd be great a tambourine works I even have something small like this little bucket and I was thinking it might work nice as like a little drum and keep the beat a grand old flag you're a high flying flag so if you want to use something like that and tap along I think we're gonna grab our instruments and we might move and groove to the beat for this too so check and make sure you have some space to move around grab your instrument and we'll be right back okay are you ready go ahead and grab whatever instrument you want to start with I'm gonna start by marching with my feet can you march with me? And I'm gonna hold my flag and I'm gonna wave it. If you don't have a flag, you can just wave with your hand, okay? Or you could wave with your arm like this if you don't have your flag. So we're gonna wave our flag a little bit and we're gonna march and move our arms, okay? Here we go, I'm gonna start the music. Get ready. <laughs> The red, white, and blue, where there's never a boast or brag. But should old acquaintance be forgot, keep your eye on the grand old flag. I'm gonna get my instrument. Ready, let's shake. You're a grand old flag, you're a high flying flag, and forever in peace may you wait. You're the emblem of the land. So instead of, I'm a little teapot, we're going to sing, I'm a little fishy, watch me swim, okay? Then we're going to find our tail. Can you find your tail? Here is my tail. And let's find our fin. Here is my fin. Good. Then we're going to move like this. When I want to have fun with my friends. We're gonna wiggle our tail, wiggle my tail. And then we're gonna dive in. Can you dive like this? And dive right in. Good, okay. So here's our swimming fishy. Here's our tail. Here's our fin. 
we're gonna have fun with our friends and dive right in. Good. All right, let's get ready. Get your fishy ready. Here we go. I'm a little fishy, watch me swim. Here is my tail and here is my fin. When I wanna have fun with my friends, I wiggle my tail and dive right in. Good! Let's try that one more time. I'm a little fishy, watch me swim. Here is my tail and here is my fin. When I wanna have fun with my friends, I wiggle my tail and dive right in. Good job, friends. I have a little fishy with me, and his name is, what's your name? Noah. Noah, this is my little son, Noah, and he's gonna be a fishy with me. Ready, stand up. All right, let's get our hands ready, and we'll be a little fishy, ready? <laughs> yeah, here we go. I'm a little fishy, watch me swim. Here is my tail. Here is my fan. When I wanna have fun with my friends, I wiggle my tail and dive right in. Mm. Good job! You wanna try it again? Mm. Oh, thank you. I give my fishy a little hug. So for our next song, we're gonna do a song you might already know. It was a song that I loved as a kid and my brother and sister loved it. It's a family favorite. This is called Down by the Bay. And the reason why I'm showing you the book is just in case you guys want, you can check it out from the Tredifferin Library or any of the libraries in the Chester County Library System. So here is um, Raffi's version of it. It's illustrated and has all the different cute little pictures. Um, I am not going to read this today, but I'm going to sing it and use my ukulele. Do you remember the ukulele that we've used before? It has four strings. Here we go. G, C, E, A. So there's my ukulele and I'm going to get my pick and we are going to sing Down by the Bay. So before we get started, if you want to use a shaker, go ahead and grab it. If you want to play, um, you can grab a drum and tap to the beat. You can do whatever you want. Or if you want to just dance around and you can echo me if you'd like. So if I sing down by the bay, you can answer me. Down by the bay, where the watermelons grow, where the watermelons grow. So if you want to echo Miss Amy, go ahead and echo me. And if you want to just dance around and listen, that's good too. All right, let's get ready. Are you ready? All right, here we go. Down by the bay, where the watermelons grow. Back to my home, I dare not go. For if I do, my mother will say, Sitting by 
the lake, down by the bay, down by the bay, where the watermelons grow, back to my home, I dare not go, for if I do, my mother will say, did you ever see an apple wearing a bapple? Did you ever see an orange eating a blouse? Wait. Did you ever have a time where you couldn't make a rhyme? Down by the bay. Yeah! Give yourselves a round of applause. Yay! That was fun. Who's ready for a story? If you're ready for a story, clap your hands. If you're ready for a story, clap your hands. If you're ready for a story, if you're ready for a story, if you're ready for a story, clap your hands. If you're ready for a story, sit so still. If you're ready for a story, sit so still. If you're ready for a story, if you're ready for a story, if you're ready for a story, sit so still. Are you ready? I have a really fun story to sing to you today because I like to read books to you that are all based on music and songs. So this one is called Over in the Ocean. And it's based on, for my parents, it's based on the song Over in the Meadow, but it's summertime, so let's check out all the creatures in the sea. So this one is called Over in the Ocean in a Coral Reef. And if you take a look, it is by Marianne Burks and it's illustrated by Jeanette Canyon. This is a very unique illustration because it's done all in clay. It is absolutely beautiful. So I hope you enjoy the song and the illustrations to go with it. Okay, here we go. Over in the ocean in a coral Over in the ocean, far away from the sun, lived a mother octopus and her octopus one. Squirt, said the mother, I squirt, said the one. So they squirted in the reef, far away from the sun. Over in the ocean where the sea grasses grew, lived a mother parrot fish and her parrot fish too. Grind, said the mother, we grind, said the two. So they ground on the coral where the sea grasses grew. Over in the ocean in a sea anemone lived an old mother clownfish and her little clownfish three. Dart, said the mother, we dart, said the three. So they darted all around in a sea anemone. Over in the ocean on a sandy sea floor lived an old mother stingray and her little stingrays four. Stir, said the mother, we stir, said the four. So they stirred with their fins on a sandy sea floor. Over in the ocean where the scuba divers dive lived an old mother puffer and her puffer fish five. Puff, said the mother, we puff, said the five. So they puffed in and out where the scuba divers dive. Over in the ocean doing somersault tricks lived an old mother dolphin and her little dolphin six. Jump, said the mother, we jump, said the six. So they jumped and they played doing somersault tricks. Over in the ocean in their sea fan heaven lived a mother angel fish and her little angel seven. 
graze, said the mother, we graze, said the seven. So they lazed and they grazed in their sea fan heaven. Over in the ocean, very streamlined and straight, lived a mother needlefish and her needlefish ate. Skitter, said the mother, we skitter, said the eight. So they skittered through the water, very streamlined and straight. Over in the ocean, drifting in a yellow line, lived an old mother gruntfish and her little gruntfish nine. Grunt, said the mother, we grunt, said the nine. So they grunted and they kissed drifting in a yellow line. Over in the ocean, in their turtle grass den, lived an old father seahorse and his seahorses ten. Flutter, said the father, we flutter, said the ten. So they fluttered all around in their turtle grass den. Over in the ocean where the sea creatures play, while their parents were all resting, they up and swam away. Find us, said the children, from ten to one. When you find all the creatures, then this rhyme is done. So if you want, I'll hold up the picture here and it'll show you counting down all those sea creatures that we had. And here is the beautiful picture. I'll hold it right here. So if you want, you could pause our little video and see if you can find and count all the beautiful sea creatures in this book. And that is the end. I hope you enjoyed it. So before we go, I just wanna say thank you for joining me for music class today. The way to say thank you in sign language is to take your hand, you touch your chin, and then you move your hand up. Thank you. And the song that we are gonna close with today is called Mahalo. Mahalo is the Hawaiian word for thank you. And this song is by Lori Berkner. I'm going to stream it using Spotify, but you can also use Amazon, Spotify, any streaming service. Um, Apple Music also uses it. So, um, and you, she also has a YouTube channel. So I wanted to just put it out there. Lori Berkner is the queen of children's music. So feel free to check her out on YouTube and subscribe to her channel. All of her songs are beautiful and she's been doing a lot of music and streaming um, and live shows for kids right now too. So if you don't know her, please feel free to check her out. And here we are going to sing Mahalo together now. Can you tap? Maybe tap your shoulders or tap your head. Or tap your fingers. Mahalo to the urchin. Mahalo to the sea. Mahalo to the skies above. Mahalo to you and me. Sing Mahalo. somewhere, wherever you'd like. Mahalo for the air I breathe. Mahalo for my dad and my mom. My sisters and my brothers and my good friends. Mahalo for sharing my song. Sing Mahalo. Thanks for being here for music today. Don't forget our words, summer and America.
Erica and Vlad. Have a great week. Let's sing together. Here we go. Sing Mahalo. Thank you, boys and girls.